हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू अनदर सीरीज ऑफ टू द पॉइंट टुडेज टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन इज फार्मास्यूटिकल पॉल्यूशन फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट सी वाई इज इट इन द न्यूज According to a research paper, pharmaceutical pollution is an overlooked but urgent issue that needs coordinated action from across the pharmaceutical, healthcare and environmental sectors. Now moving on to the key findings of the report. Almost half or 43% of the world's rivers are contaminated with active pharmaceutical ingredients in concentrations it can have disastrous ramifications on health now let's discuss what is pharmaceutical or drug pollution it is mainly a form of water pollution caused by pharmaceutical drugs and their molecules which reach the aquatic environment through waste water The chemicals will seep into the surrounding freshwater systems and eventually into the oceans, lakes, streams and rivers. It is now detected in waters throughout the world and its causes include effluents from pharmaceutical manufacturing, aging infrastructure such as water treatment plants which cannot filter our two small molecules, sewage overflows, drugs in urine and excreta. and agricultural runoff antibiotic use in livestock now let's have a look at the status of pharmaceutical in india india is the world's third largest producer of pharmaceuticals about 3000 drug companies and about 10500 manufacturing units are involved In India the dominant pharma industries are located in the city of Hyderabad known as the bulk drug capital of India According to the survey local people argue that the groundwater is highly contaminated in the regions where industries are situated It has been estimated that about 60000 new bonds die annually in India because of multi drug resistance infections Here pharmaceutical water pollution with antimicrobial drugs is responsible for that. Now lastly let's discuss about the effects on human health. For example androsine disruptor chemicals or EDCs example endosulfan directly influence sex hormones. On aquatic life a suspected contributor in fish kills amphibian die offs etc and long term effects on the environment some pharmaceutical compounds can persist for long in the environment and in water supplies these bioaccumulate enter a cell and move up food chains becoming more concentrated in the process now it's time for the practice question consider the following statements regarding the pharmaceutical pollution One, it is mainly a form of water pollution. Two, almost half of the world's rivers are contaminated with active pharmaceutical ingredients in concentrations. Which of the above given statement or statements is or are not correct? One only, two only, both one and two, or neither one nor two? Send the answer of this question in the comment section. Stay tuned for the next episode. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Dear viewers, watch this topic in Hindi on our Drishti IS Hindi YouTube channel.